Welcome back to Old Man Gaming, where we're checking our mailbox in WoW. See how much uh, I've made from the shadow ingots. I know there's some shadow something ingots, but you know. Ancient to trade? Oh, well, Needs that's not the mailbox, is it? Well, as you can see, I got a bunch in my inventory. The price is tanked. I'm not going to sell them at 47. It's too little. All right, let's put them in and see, just for fun. So I got all these. I've done a couple of resets. That's why I've got so many. It's only going to be 300k. Yeah, I think I'd be losing money. All right, so exotic, there's the mailbox. But the ones that we did sell, they sold for a good price. So we can see we made 30k off of those. And then I've been making other things, as you can see. And uh, you know, on some of them, the the cost is so minimal to make. I make two or three hundred. Well, I see. So for all the stuff that's made there, I probably made, as, as a profit, I would say 2,000 gold plus whatever the ingots have in there, the shadow gas ingots. Um, I mean, this might be some profit because I know the last market reset I did was like 90K. And then our last mailbox cleanup, we had like 200K or something, if I remember right. So... There is some profit in here. I just don't know how much at the moment. But we'll pick this up. It's a pretty decent total. Uh, it's Friday now, so I'm hoping the weekend the prices will change, but we'll see. Or if not, I mean, if, if a lot gets sold and I can make a cheap market reset, maybe I will. <laughs> I don't know. But... Uh, What we'll do now is we'll go ahead and check uh, some Wugren, see what he's got. I don't even remember what we're doing with him, so, um, so I'll pause the video and we'll be checking out my other character. All right, here we are back with Sun Wugren, and uh, let's take a look at the mailbox, see what we got. All right, this is great, 21K. That's actually pretty good. Considering, let's take a look. This is the big thing right here. And it, what is it? It's transmog. People say it doesn't sell, but it does. Look at that. 20K. That's, that's perfect, you know. All the rest of stuff is just things that I've been doing. So this is, uh, wow. Had that for quite a while. Here's another. I mean, it doesn't sell for much. But when you get these big items, it's really nice to see them sell. So that's really cool. That's, uh, that's a pretty decent amount. Pick that up. I think I need to start making some bags with him. See how that looks back. Let's take a look at the price on the bags. To trade? So on one of my la uh, last videos, I got a question on like what would be good uh, like or some tips for new gold makers. So one is just check your markets here. Take a look. So know what, what you need to buy. So in this case, I need the light silk or lightless silk. It's eight gold. And then the bags themselves that I make out of them are way down here somewhere. Here, 380. So you need to know what the price is uh, to make a bag and a price to sell the bag and uh, see if you make a profit. Now, one thing you can do. If you find anything um, exotic, Bring it to me. Oops, that's the wrong if you one. Find anything exotic, um, bring it to me. You need to learn to use TSM as well. TSM is going to give you some really great um, insight. So here we can see it says that the lightless silk pouches, uh, I'd make about 50 gold on if I started making them. So what we can see is... Um, just wondering what the price they're going to see. So that's at nine. So I'd actually make more because I can get this thread at seven gold. Uh, and the silk, it, is it saying the silk's at nine as well? Because it was showing it was at eight. All right, well, anyway, I'm going to buy some silk because it looks like it's a good deal. Ancient to trade? Needs to be at least that's the eight, seven, five. We'll buy, I think I need 1,500. Two, so it's 885, yeah. And then I need to get the thread. I mean, I got if a little you find bit. Anything exotic, bring it to me. But um, I don't get it from here. I have to go back to um, 
the other expansion. <laughs> I forget what it's called. Yeah. Wonder if I play this game very much. I do play the game a lot. I just I my memory isn't working as well as I'd like it to. So sometimes I remember, sometimes I don't. But we'll travel off over to Ogremar and then. Actually, I wish like my. I don't have my. Uh, uh, so I can't remember what it's called. <laughs> but I don't have it high enough in Ogremar. I have to go to. Uh, here, to Zoltazar. Yeah. Reputation. My goodness. Totally forgetting in my brain here. So, yes. Uh, my reputation is not as good in Ogremar as it is in Soldazar. It was kind of strange, except I actually was had to do all the flight stuff here to, uh, you know, Pathfinder 1, Pathfinder 2 to actually uh, get flight in here. So that's why my reputation is better. So we'll just fly down to this lady here. Grab some silk or uh, thread. Only the finest goods. Here, see, I get it for 720 here. Over there, it's like nine something or even more. Uh, I think I need. Is it 2500? I forget how much it is. We'll get 2500. We'll start with that. I don't remember the exact amount. Forgot to pick up the uh, silk. Uh, all bots. Took a few days on those. I'm gonna keep a track. Keep track on those. It's a sad thing. I lost probably three million dollars of stuff there. <laughs> so, all right. Well, we're making pouches. I'm gonna put them in. I'll leave the video here. And uh, if you're watching and haven't yet, please subscribe. It lets me know that you guys like these things, and I'll keep making them. And, uh, yeah, if you have comments, questions, uh, want more tips, let me know in the comments. I'll be happy to share any more tips I can think of. Uh, whether it's about transmog farming and uh, or crafting and things like that. If you need help with TSM, um, I can go through that as well. But uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.